How to treat incisions First, stop the bleeding. Minor cuts and scrapes usually stop bleeding on their own. If they don't, apply gentle pressure with a clean cloth or bandage. Hold the pressure continuously for 20 to 30 minutes. Second, rinse out the wound with clear water. Soap can irritate the wound, so try to keep it out of the actual wound. If dirt or debris remains in the wound after washing, Use tweezers cleaned with alcohol to remove the particles. If debris remains embedded in the wound after cleaning, see your doctor. Third, cover the wound. Bandages can help keep the wound clean and keep harmful bacteria out. After the wound has healed enough to make infection unlikely, exposure to the air will speed wound healing. Change the dressing at least daily or whenever it becomes wet or dirty. If you're allergic to the adhesive used in most bandages, switch to adhesive-free dressings or sterile gauze held in place with paper tape, gauze roll, or a loosely applied elastic bandage. If you have a wound that is more than 1 4th inch or 6 mm deep or is gaping or jagged edged and has fat or muscle protruding, usually requires stitches. Also, watch for signs of infection. See your doctor if the wound isn't healing or if you notice any redness, increase in pain, drainage, warmth, or swelling. But if you can't easily close the mouth of the wound, see your doctor as soon as possible.